This is definitely one of the hardest times to be a COD fan because the newest COD is coming out and you're so excited for it and then you play the beta and you kind of get a sense of what you're getting into. And I'm going to be so honest with you guys because there's a lot that I want to say in this video. But I'm going to get my thoughts of the beta because this is definitely one of those CODs that is so polarizing because there's so much good and yet there's so much bad. But I do want to provide some context before I say anything else. I have put about 20 plus hours in into the beta i still have to unlock 10 more levels to unlock everything but when i tell you i don't even know if i want to grind anymore i feel as that should say something but all right guys beside that i did participate in weekend one of the beta and it's currently the second week and has really anything major changed well they did nerf the jackal pdw because that was the most broken gun in weekend one of the beta it shredded and pounded anything in the way pause they added one more map some new perks and guns but they mostly fixed a lot of bug fixes game balancing and quality of life improvements which i really do appreciate and other than that that's really the gist of it so i have to be quite honest the beta by far is the worst beta that i've ever played and that hurts to say because this is coming from my favorite cod developer which this even hurts even more just to say to be honest with you guys and you're telling me this is the same studio who created black ops 1 and 2 it's so sad to say, but yes, this is the same studio that created those masterpieces. But honestly, guys, let's just jump into my positives before I say anything bad. To start off, the game feels visually and graphically great. It feels really well handled, but the optimi optimization could use a little bit of work. I have a 3060 PC, like my graphics card, and I have 48 gigs of RAM, and I also have a uh, AMD Ryzen what is it 5500 or something i can't remember what my specs are completely off the top of my head but my pc is not that bad like it, it's kind of outdated but it's not that bad it's like one generation behind the gunsmith overhaul feels so amazing and the customization for weapons this time around is great because there's not like 20 plus attachments that they're useless and don't really add anything this time around also I, this is i'm not only speaking for the beta but i'm also speaking for the full launch when it comes when it does come in october there is a lot of content beside the beta only having limited content but there's a, going to be a lot of content at launch which i'm happy to say like the 16 multiplayer maps and campaign zombies has two brand new maps like this is a full-fledged four-year game that I'm actually proud of and i know i'm criticizing it in just a second but i'm really happy about that the time to kill is really good it's not that bad but it's not really in like a place where i really want to dictate it i would say it's balanced currently and pretty much that is my positives don't take everything so personal this is just my opinion right like this is just how i feel during my playthrough of the beta because it was not good man i was lagging like crazy and i was the only one playing <laughs> and i was the only one on the internet which makes no sense at all and i do have a funny story i actually had to upgrade my internet just to play this stupid beta i mean it was a it was something that I was planning on doing, but um, this is literally the reason why I had to upgrade my internet because this game was lagging so bad on me. And that's where my positives end and my negatives are up next. But please, before I say anything else, I am aware that this is a beta and not the full game. And that's why I'm criticizing the beta and what I've played so far. I will wait for when it comes out, but now for my negatives the game is so damn sweaty skill based matchmaking is ramped up so much look at this clip literally like the beginning of the game everybody was going crappy like or not crappy everyone was going so sweaty man which is so crazy it's so difficult to just have a casual experience man it's so damn difficult i'm not the best i know that but i don't want to feel like i have to sweat for my life just to enjoy the game next the omni movement is terrible i know this is going to be a controversial one but i really don't enjoy the omni movement i think it's very terrible but i am i am appreciative of the fact that it is going to make a skill gap with most people and some people are going to be good this year some people are going to be bad i think i'm going to be in that bad category and again i know some people may not agree with that but it's just my opinion if you're butt hurt i wouldn't watch this video but again the omni movement is terrible and i know some people enjoy it and please don't let my experience ruin it for you guys i want this to be enjoyable but for me it's not and i really i really did imagine liking it but honestly i don't next 
and this is gonna be kind of sad to say the maps are pretty terrible they're all small based maps to be more in line with the idea of omni movement which again kind of makes it even worse which don't get me wrong it sounds good on paper but in execution it's bad lastly guys this is going to be my last bad thing about the game the modern warfare gameplay is prevalent in this year's game and what i'm saying is black ops 6 feels so much like modern warfare but yes i understand that they're running on the same engine but there should be some type of difference between the games but like the movement and even the gameplay feels like it and i don't even know why people aren't even talking about this there's a lot of like in-game things that just look like modern warfare and feel like modern warfare the gameplay the animations i don't really want to jump into it because i think this is the point that i feel only personally maybe there is a small portion out there that do feel the same way but again i say this every time too the game is just a copy and paste of last year's call of duty every single year call of duty is a copy and paste of last year or the year before that it's essentially the same thing and i get i get it call of duty is a money making machine there's also a lot of good but there's also a lot of bad and that's unfortunate man it's really unfortunate but yes those are my biggest criticisms but yes these are my biggest criticisms and my excitement for the game has been kind of tarnished because of the beta and i'm not entirely convinced this game took four years to make because it just doesn't feel like it because the game feels like cold war met modern warfare and had a baby but other than that guys if you guys did enjoy this video please like and subscribe and also 98 percent of you guys are not subscribed so let's change that so you guys don't miss my next video other than that guys take care and i'll see you guys in my next video